Well, congratulations. You just signed up for your free trial of the Sofio Automotive E-Commerce Web Store Package. Okay, now, since you signed up, you're probably saying to yourself, okay, so what exactly did I do? Well, you actually did a lot of things. Number one, when you filled out that form, you created an account within the Sofio support system. So this means you can send us an email and ask us any questions that you might have. Secondly, we created an entire framework for your new web store. Now, the URL to your store is not going to be as clean as demo.sofio.com, but it might say something like 1234-5678.sofio.com. Those random numbers are used for us internally for tracking. The minute that you get a, a, a sign up for a support package, you can get a domain name either from us or from another company, and you can point that domain name to your trial or to your actual web store. So don't, so don't worry about the domain name. Now, when you sign up, we also attach one of the many different catalogs um, that we integrate with our system. Now, the catalog that is integrated with your free trial store is a catalog you can use in production. And if you do that, we'll actually fulfill the orders for you with one of our many different suppliers. But to do that, we have to have your credit card number and expiration date and billing address and all that good stuff on file. Now, let's take a look um, at the dashboard. So. When you log in, you're going to actually log in to the page called admin.epc. Okay, admin.epc um, is where you see your actual dashboard, and it's where you're going to see your sales, and you're going to be able to access your customers and any open orders that you might have. Now, to get support, you would simply click the support link here. So let's do that. Okay, so after you click the support link, you're going to first and automatically be brought to the open ticket area. And from here, if you want to ask us a question, you can ask it by clicking on support, design, or billing. Please do your best to choose the right department. As you can see, for example, the design department is billable. So really any question you have that you think should be a free question, just simply click on support. If you have a question about your bill, obviously you'll click on the billing link right here. Okay, now the reason I brought you here was if you want us to drop ship your orders, um, you're gonna first need to download and complete what we call the brokerage form. Okay, so we're gonna click on the support menu and then downloads. Okay, and you can see here the credit card authorization form or brokerage form is right here. If we give that a click, depending on what browser you're using, it should just open up on your screen. Now I think mine's gonna open up as a PDF file and let's see what information we have to get from you. All right, so as you can see here, um, it's pretty obvious, right? We're gonna need your, your name, your company name, your domain name, whoops, sorry your name, your company name, domain name, name on the card, the address where we mail, where the statement is mailed. You're gonna have to read this, sign it, okay? And you can either scan it and um, email it to us back to support, or you can fax it to us at our toll-free number here, okay? And what that's gonna do is every single time you try to process an order, we're gonna charge your credit card for the cost of the parts, and then we're gonna drop ship the order to you. You, of course, are gonna collect the money from your consumer via your own credit card gateway account. Now let's just talk about that for a second. If you uh, are not a business that is currently accepting credit cards at your website, you have a couple different ways you can deal with this. First of all, if we click on payment, the payment tab in our store settings, okay, let me slow down and show you that again. If we click on settings, all right, and then we click on payment, you'll see here that we have a number of payment gateways that we work with. Now, uh, authorized.net is a popular one, but you can see if we click on the drop-down list, we have a bunch, of course, which includes PayPal. Definitely recommend considering the PayPal Web Payments Pro Package. Costs about 30 bucks a month, and the rates are great. Now, remember, processing credit cards is up to you. So your store, when you set it up with us, is not gonna automatically process credit cards. You're gonna have to get a payment gateway. So the two things you have to do to use your store in production, in other words, at your own domain name, are one, buy a domain name and get it pointed to your Sofio store. Two, you're gonna sign up for a payment gateway, and a payment gateway can be as simple as using a PayPal checkout, which is entirely free. You can just go to paypal.com and sign up as a business and give us your uh, PayPal email address. And number three, you're gonna have to log into support, okay, go to the support, and then downloads page, and then choose the credit card authorization form. This is a separate document that allows us to charge your credit card for all of your parts orders. 
Okay, that's all we have time for today. That's a basic introduction to what you have to do to get started. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to click on the support link and create a support ticket. You can ask for a call back and we can schedule a call with one of our project management specialists. Thanks so much and we wish you the best of luck.